pull up on your mocking dread. Then a monte. Woke wine. Today is the dowry payment of Nene Wokoye. And according to the laws of Anyoma Kindred, the grant Ibanku will take place next AK market day. Nobody will go to the market. Nobody will go to the farm. Everybody will converge at Wokoye compound. They are here. I know. Oh my God, he's so handsome. Cheta, you don't have to remind me. I'm not talking about Kenny. Oh. Then who? You might not to be a good one. Hey, if you're going to Allah, I ask you going to Amos. So I'm not going to call you to your idea. How far are you going? That's it. Aha. Hey. Yeah. Oh, God, but you. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Bye. Ndewo. 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 Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir. I got no leather, man. Mommy, no, no. Yeah. Oh. Welcome. Ah, so. Ndewo, I'm going to take a look at my nose, huh? No, no. Very soon, my younger brother will be here. And the dowry payment ceremony will commence. How God bless you, you man. You know when the soup and uh, maybe apple uh, and the gusi is very sweet. You know we don't we don't need to wait. No ben ye, no ben. You know. Go ahead. Yes. So, uh, mommy, let me let me yeah. let me see my wife to be. I'm a woman. I'm a boy. I'm a on them. Hey, 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 wow, you look gorgeous, <laughs> drop dead gorgeous. How are you? I'm good, thank you, sweetheart. 
Thank you. Um, I'm so excited. Come, come give me a hug. Come. Uh, can I, we can't hug. Why? Remember the doctrine of my church? It forbids it. Okay. <laughs> we just called him sweeter instead of Brother Kenny. <laughs> you didn't remember your church doctrine then? Chata, please, <laughs> don't just start. Please. But anyways, I, I said let me come and see you first. And then, let me head back. Hmm? I'm sure they will be looking for me now. So, um, can I touch you at least? Mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. All right. I'll see you soon. I don't understand you, Nene. So you can't hug your husband today? I can't, and you know why. Mama, what is it? Again? Yeah? What? 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 Easy, easy. Yeah? We forgot the cola nuts at home. We forgot the cola nuts? Mama, why now? Why? Stop huh? blaming me. You can rush to any nearby market here and get it. How can you forget Kola not that? Oh, can they go, go, oh, go? Oh, yeah, police or oh, on up, up, where we are. Go, go, go. Okay, go. I'll be back. Uh, tell Lota like, um, I'm coming. I know what you're talking about now. I believe Rosim. Nga Boggy. Nga Boggy cool down. Yes. Nga Boggy Gazo. Where is Kenny? Uh, he's somewhere around. I should be back in the next couple of minutes. Oh, okay. Eh, that reminds me. I don't like how you supported our fool at the party, Luta. Like, I don't get it. This is not the first time I've caught him. Why are men so polygamous? Why? <laughs> ah, you know, you ladies should try to find out why. Uh-huh, and you think we haven't, and the same result keeps popping up. Really? Yes. And that is? The men have this DNA of infidelity in their veins. Ah, uh, save it, child. Oh, tata. Yes. Yeah. Uh -huh. I've been the shadow of myself for so long just to please another. I've been the shadow of myself for so long just to please another. Oh, now this is me. Kenne. Chosen to do me and be responsible for all my actions. And it's so bad. You? Welcome back, Kenne. You see? 
I never wanted our paths to cross again. Same here. I never wanted our paths to cross ever again. What do you want? <laughs> wow. Are you for real? What do I want? Kenne? If you want nothing, why then did you kidnap me? Well, just shut that mouth of yours! You're the only person who knows me in and out in this planet. For me, time is money and I wouldn't waste it on some garbage like you. In that case, spill it out. Because I have to go and pay my wife's diary in a few minutes. They are waiting for me. Congratulations. I didn't bring you here to mess your little ceremony. How long have you been going out with her? I mean your fiancé. Why do you want to know? I'm just concerned. Is your husband aware that you are here with your ex? Stop being cunning. If you want to ask if I'm married, come off straight and ask like a man. Why must you say it that way? You know me. I'm as blunt as blunt. <sighs> Our pattern was requisite. Of course. That. Of course. You knew me before you chose to go out with me. I unraveled everything before you, but you swept it under the carpet wit. It doesn't matter. Those were your words, isn't it? My daughter. Mama. How are you? I am very fine. Mama, you look so beautiful. Wow. <laughs> Thank you, my daughter. <laughs> Where is your mother? Um, she went to my uncle's house to get something. Yeah. It's okay. <laughs> yeah, well, you see, a uh, guard mm -hmm. designed men to plant seeds and the women to incubate and produce the seed. Why is she laughing? That's so funny. <laughs> you uploaded those filthy lines into your hard drives, right? <laughs> well, the lines may be filthy to you, but I'm sorry. That's exactly how God wired men to function. But again, that doesn't mean we don't love our wives, though. No, it doesn't mean that. Lusa, that isn't love at all. Mm. Mm. Sister Chota, yes, the is calling you. Okay, I'm calling you. Okay. Mm. All right, I get it, I get it. You know, this may sound stupid, but... Uh... Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> that does not sound stupid. It is quite stupid. Mm. Please. Anyways, excuse me, I'm mm. coming. No, you won't understand. I don't blame you. I want to ask you a question, Kenne. Ask. 
I have noticed that you don't finish things. Why? Some things are not supposed to be finished. <laughs> Some things are better open-ended than trying to bring it to an end. Well, I think that's an idiosyncratic idea. It's not. It is. Because everything that has a beginning has an end, and every end has a new beginning. Are you trying to infer that in our court marriage, Chinemer? <laughs> Do you think I was talking about our marriage? That's if that was a marriage in the first place. You see, my daughter, one thing a mother desires for her son is a homely daughter-in-law. Of course, Mama. Owing to the fact that we are all Christians, you see, having godly children and grandchildren are very essential. That is very true, Mama. Yes. That is true. <laughs> Hi, oh, Mama. You look very beautiful. Good day, Ma. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you, my dear. Yeah. Hey, you called me. When did I call you? Eh? I'm with Mama. Just go. I'll call you when I'm done with her. Okay, Ma. Later. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> so, my daughter. You see? <laughs> What are you talking about? Are you saying that our wedding was not authentic? Of course, it was not a marriage. We had a court wedding. Oh my gosh, are you listening to me? I am listening. No, you were not listening. You hear with your head and you listen with your heart. You hear to reply and you listen to respond. If you are listening to what I'm saying, then you will understand that what I am talking about is marriage and not wedding. Wedding is an event. Marriage is a process. True. But event is still the gateway to that process. <laughs> okay. Let's tread that path of logical sense. You see, that's the part I do not like about you. But you started it. Logic and emotions don't go together. But you are the one who is bringing logic and emotions together here. <laughs> there you go. After this years, you're still a man I've known. Blame game expert.
Back to what we're talking about. Yeah, okay. Uh, you know, can I say that you and Nana are medical students? Yes. You look smart. <laughs> are you just noticing that now? <laughs> Come on, sorry now. Hmm. And you look uh, hot. <laughs> well, I guess most of the medical students I know are smart anyway. <laughs> you think so? Of course. I mean, hey, you have to be smart to be a medical student. Uh, no, don't be too sure. Really? Because I can assure you, most of those guys in med school, they just read to pass their exams. Hmm. Well, I believe you still have to be smart to pass medical exams. Am I right? Yeah, why are you looking at me like that? Please. Do you have plans? <laughs> I can see that. I like it when a plan comes together. <laughs> I see. I've really added some weight. My daughter, let me tell you this tale. When I was single, my late mother stressed on the need for me marrying his good Christian brother with bed on the front. Back then, I was so slender that after our wedding, people were asking if I would borrow a waist to give bed. <laughs> it was that serious. <laughs> really? <laughs> I'm telling you so. <laughs> but, you know, these days, things are so twisted. I mean, back then, men preferred chubby women. These days, it's different. <sighs> yes. These days, young men are here to come to terms with the body structure of women. Mm. <laughs> Remind me, what do you do again? <laughs> I fix things. Mm. Things like what? Lives. You can call me Mr. AMG. I fix people's lives. Nah, 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 I'm just messing with you. See, yeah, I fix phones, mm? Mm. laptops, you know, generally electronic gadgets, yeah. Wait, I don't look it. Pregnant and nursing mothers are usually fat. Yes, their body organs are widely open. So any man who is complaining that his wife is fat is either crazy or insane. Yes. You call me an expert at blame game? Yes, both of us know. Do not use that word, both of us. Don't. Before we began, I told you I had a record of overlapping relationships with guys. But you came and ended it with, I'm sorry, we can't continue. I know, but... It was my mother who... That was why I said it was not a marriage in the first place. Because it was full of what your mother wanted for you. <laughs> well, you don't look like you fix those things. Hmm. <laughs> or like you studied E in school? Do I have to study? That to fix things? <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I can really pop your brakes. You didn't attend. No, I didn't. I didn't attend formal institution if that's what you mean. I'm not a degree holder. Yes. Uh, see, I just walk up one brother. I might come with the house to fix these things. Uh, you know. <laughs> 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 Leave my mother out of this. See? 
See what went wrong between both of us. I have told you to stop using that word, both of us. Okay. Like I was saying, if what went on between us was a thing, then both of No. You and I would be the protagonist, and your mother will be the antagonist. Meaning? It means what it means. I am lost, and that was why I said meaning. Kenny, your life hangs on the pendulum of your mother's desire. I will not take that from you. I swear down. Neme, I will not take that from you. It's incredible. Meanwhile, it's good. It is good. Yeah, thank you. At least it's better than sitting idle. You're right. It's okay. Life is imperfect. <laughs> Let me ask you a question. Do you believe in the word perfect? Sure. <laughs> I don't. Why? All right, let me break it down so you can understand. You see, I believe the concept of the word perfect was created to make us imperfect. And if nobody is perfect, then being imperfect is the perfect thing to be. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Lutari philosopher. No, no, no. Is actually more like a Mr. Aristotle Luther the philosopher. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got you there. Sorry, Mama. I... I went to ease myself. No problem, my dear. Like I was saying, your mother was my classmate in secondary school. She was your size. Uh-uh. You are fatter than her. Yes. I defended her back in school because she was so slender. Chai. Yes, yes. She told me you defended her so much back then. Yes, my dear. You know your mother was the quiet type then. And whenever she was intimidated, I took it up. <laughs> yeah, uh, come to think of it, it's actually true. Yeah, but Correct me if I'm wrong. I don't think there's ever been anybody that attained that perfect state. Wow. Lota. Wow. You do have an incredible mind, you know. <laughs> Thank you. But I believe you have the same kind of mind, too. But I get this feeling that you're disappointed that I didn't go to school like you did. Well, 
to be candid, yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. But then, you amaze me actually. What I know is that did. Well, yeah. You know, most people actually wished that I did. Ah, uh, trust me, I am first on that list. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> she told me you went viral after you fought a guy everybody was scared of back then. That is true. <laughs> but she's changed. I think it's because of marriage. Yes. Marriage changes people. Really? Yes, my daughter. It does not change only the body of a woman. It also changes their behavior. Yeah, uh, I've been doing a lot of thinking lately and I found out that our inflexible aspirations, right, about other people make us susceptible to deceit. Yeah. Hmm. I can disagree with you on a lot of things. But you see this, it is very true. Wait a minute. Are you trying to tell me something? <laughs> Mm. It seems you want me to scatter this bright price ceremony. Or better still, you want me to tear the whole bright price ceremony apart. Uh, and then, <laughs> Nene would poison me. Mm. You can ask your mother, she will tell you. Huh. What did you mean when you said marriage changes behavior? Yes, my daughter. It hinges on the family of whom you marry. Yes. The culture we met from this part of the world taught us that we marry a family and not a person. But the Westerners are not like that. But we are blacks. It was for that matter. Family is paramount to us, Nene. <sighs> Why did you recommend me to your son? It is a long story. I doubt if I would exhaust it now. We have time. I'm dying to hear the story. Do you know why what I said hurts? Because it's the truth. Truth hurts. That's not true. Then why were you hurt? Lies hurts also. Broken relationships hurt the most. I don't know how to describe it. It's a weird kind of feeling. I feel the pleasure of love lasts for a moment and the pain of love lasts a lifetime. It's different the way they show it on Nollywood films. It's deep. The tricky part is that you look healthy on the outside. And it got me asking. 
a spin in the flesh or in the soul. Pain is in the flesh. One can be all right on the outside, yet still feel pain. I think pain is both in the flesh and the soul. Yeah, uh, Kenna is a friend turned brother. Hmm. I like that. Really? Mm-hmm. Well, the truth is, we have watched over each other from day one. I mean, ground zero. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, Sheta, between you and I, hmm, if there's anything I need to know that's going to help my friend, Kenne, Biko, I need to know now, please. It's very important that I know right now. Luther, I don't know if you know those quotes, um, something like, um, Esteem relationship over issues. Yeah, I think I've read that stuff. I've come across it in the past. But again, issues can hamper relationships. Come on, you know that now. Mm. You think brilliantly. You actually do think out of the box <laughs> like that. I always think outside the box. <laughs> <laughs> It could have worked out between both of us, if not for Did my... Did you just say both of us? Can you just listen to me? Can you? Okay. You know, chatting with you, you <laughs> you're so amusing. <laughs> but then, it's true. <laughs> ah, anyway, don't mind me. I actually studied philosophy. <laughs> uh, <laughs> no wonder. <laughs> you know, there's this saying that wisdom is the rightful application of knowledge, right? Mm-hmm. Wrong. The definition is so faulty. Mm. Mm hmm And then what is your own definition? <laughs> All right. I think uh, that wisdom is the insight into the true nature of things. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Quite deep, right? Mm. You didn't think about it. It could have worked out between both of us. If not for my mother's prescribed qualities of a woman I must marry. I tried to win her affection, but she was so bent on hating me because of the life I once lived. My mother wanted a godly ground seeds. Okay. Can I met this lady by name Chine Merem while in school? This is not relevant, Nene. Oh, no, 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 mommy, please continue, please. But Ken should have told you about it by now. He did not. Why? You know him. He's always saying just leave the past in the past. This can itself. 
That was what she desired. And I do not blame her. Because I would have desired such if I was raised the same way she was. What? No hard feelings against her on that. I forgive her. But... Mama, please, tell me. Because he guards his past like a treasure, and I don't know why. Really? Yes. Maybe the woman left an indelible print on his heart. I don't think so, Nene. <sighs> Mama, I know what I'm saying. I know what I'm saying. See, people may cross paths in life and then separate. But most times, the memory stays. Yes. I can remember how my late mother dissolved my relationship with the first man I ever dated. Just because he was not as Christianized as she wanted him to be. It took me years to gain control over my emotions. Hmm. My daughter, let me tell you about my son's relationship. But then what? I expected you were going to stand by me through those periods. Gina, you know, if if there was anything I could have done to save our, to save us, I wouldn't have hesitated. Do you know how much I wanted to be in your family? Because I'm from a broken home. There is no one who appreciates family more than someone from a broken home. Where parents leave their children to do anyhow they deem good. I, I wasn't fortunate to have the kind of upbringing that you had. That's what I wanted for my children. <gasps> my father was a drunk. My mother <laughs> had to sleep with anyone who agrees to her price so she could <laughs> fend for my sister and I. I, I grew up thinking that that was the path of life. Until I met you. You know what I liked about you the first time that we met? What? Sharpness. Yeah, you have a sharp mind. You see, I like women, ladies that I can reason with. Not some bubble-headed losers masquerading as chicks. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> okay. I understand. I also like guys that make sense when they speak. Oh. Um, let's say, um... Smart guys, to be precise. <laughs> uh, trust me, I know when a smart woman is trying to play smart. Hmm. Really? Mm-hmm. All right. 
Why do I get this feeling that you're trying to avoid the question I asked you about your friend, Nana? The issue is that you tilted to your mother's side. You avoided your mother's challenge. Avoiding challenge breaks you than it makes you. It is said that the muscles grow bigger when it is stressed. My mother is always on my neck. What would I have done? Disobey her? Disobeying your mother is not the point I'm trying to make. Children owe their parents respect and obedience. Anyone who doesn't respect someone's parent is I am not in their shoes. I expected you to come to terms with the fact that you had a relationship with me that shouldn't have been at the mercy of your mother's opinion. That boundary should not be crossed. I know. Listen, my mother will not stop until she gets what she wants. Nemeram, you know all this. She let her bring you to that point. And often, she gets what she wants out of you. You feel helpless miserable you wish you could take decisions for yourself and take a firm stand come on now disclosing someone's secret is a betrayal of trust you know well there's no secret anymore how do you mean you see, whenever you tell a secret to someone, there's no longer a secret. How? Because whatever you tell somebody in confidence, they also have someone that they love. And you know what love makes people do? Love makes you do things, tell things. Okay. Now, you know the hardest shit to do? What? Keeping a secret from someone you love. Hmm. That's true. Yeah. You see, love makes keeping secrets practically impossible. And when you're in love, you simply cannot do that. Hmm. Now, what I'm about to tell you, you may not like it, but I'll say it just the same. You see, when you keep a secret from someone you love, it's a clear indication that there's a red flag somewhere. And that, my dear, that is not love. Why are you saying all this after seven years you left? I never left. You did. No. You packed your bags and left. Yes. I packed my bags and left. But your emissions left first. So, technically, you left before I did. You shouldn't have, Neme. You never have. You shouldn't have.
when I left. People love where they are celebrated, not tolerated. Perhaps you're right. Something happened before I left. That's why I'm here. Is it Jato? To be perfectly honest, I'd like us to work something out. Hmm? <laughs> Please, Luta, don't even start. Can we just go back to what we're talking about? <laughs> okay. Oh. No wahala. Hmm. But wait. Why did you support my ex when I told you what he did? Did I? I was only trying to explain what triggered his actions. Nothing more. Uh, I don't even know why you men tend to support your fellow guys when you do this. Hmm. You know, that includes you ladies too. Oh, please. Okay, fine. Why are you protecting Nene? Uh, you know, I don't understand how he let her sleep. It doesn't matter. Oh, Sooner or later, it was bound to slip from your tongue one way or the other. Oh, I see. That's what you think? Naturally. Definitely. Can I my son date the so-called name? I can't remember how many years. But they did court wedding. I learned that she had this twisted past multiple abortions. And uh, please, where is she from? Um, what's the name of this place again? Let's forget it. Okay. The main point is that I want my son to marry a virgin. And I know you are. Seriously speaking, hmm? is your friend you know, dating someone that Kenya doesn't know? Of? <laughs> uh, Luther, I wish that was the case. I just really wish. Hmm. You know, Kenya's mom practically runs his life. No, not really. The mother means well for him, and come on, it's normal with mothers. That's what they do. It's only natural. I get you, but that kind of love tends to turn into possession. Will I say possession, or it just becomes possessive? I don't know. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. You're right. You're right. When a mother can't even let their children make up, make their own choices, I don't. I don't get it. I don't. And that, that is not right also. Things often go wrong when a mother thinks they can play the role of God in the life of their kids. Yeah, you're making a very salient point there. Lusa.
Your friend Kenny. He's in, he's in a very big mess. And you know what? He would never find out. Never. I don't know. Hmm. What do you mean? No, no. What do you mean he's in a mess? My daughter, these days, eh, young people often misinterpret we mothers when we try to help our children find the right girl. They say we are controlling our children's life. But it takes a mother to know the right girl for her son. My daughter, you know these days, girls are deceitful. And it takes old eyes like us to spot them. You know, one's previous life is very, very essential. Because if one marries a wayward person, they will have wayward children. What happened? Wow. You care so much to me. Nema, you know I care so much. Kenne. What could be keeping Kenne now, eh? What could I not call Jayikote from there? What's holding him? I don't know. It's possibly traffic. Oh, no. Yeah, that reminds me. You were saying something. <laughs> Luta, are you sure you still want this ceremony to go on? I do. <laughs> I do. Like someone who is giving a solemn vow at the altar. <laughs> who knows? <laughs> See. This is for your ears alone. Scout's honor. I promise. Are you sure? Yes. Okay. Here's the point. Nema, I, I don't have time. Time is the least of my concern now. What's your concern? I have your son. What? He's seven. Jesus Christ. Chinema, why did you wait this long to tell me? Why? I took in the last time we met. Jesus.
Neme, Neme. Why are you telling me this now? Why? Huh? Don't you dare strike that chord again. What should I tell you? When was I supposed to tell you? My coming here is because of Ife Chuku. His name is Ife Chuku. He's been bugging me with questions, lots of questions. Who is my father? Where is my father? And all that. I don't know what else to tell him. I was advised to contact you. So you can plan how to meet him. How do I even believe you? Don't you dare ask that silly question again. Else, I'll go back and tell your son that you are dead. I dare you. I don't need you to take care of my son. I can take care of him myself. You little piece of shit. My card. Ring me if you want to meet him. My boys will pick you up and drop you so you can meet up with your little ceremony. Good luck. Chosen to do me and be responsible for all my actions. And it's so bad. Now I can't walk back on my do. And it's so bad. How it has gotten out of hand. Ooh, oh. Now this is me, oh, me and my fears, oh, I'll face my fears headlong and I will be fine. Shadow of myself for so long just to please another. I've been the shadow of myself for so long just to please another. Oh, now this is me. Uh, mm -hmm. This thing I want to tell you. There are three people that know, four people know about this. Mm. Okay, I'm listening. I, Nene, mm -hmm. God, 
and Satan. No, 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 leave the last idiot. Talk to me. And that's not the worst. Kenny is not responsible. What is wrong with you? Nothing. Ah, oh, don't tell me that. Your absence in class have been apparent to everyone. Tell me, what is it? know about this. Oh. Who is responsible? Oh. Emeka. How many weeks? Three weeks. Oh. Three weeks. Mm. Can I come in to pay my bride price next week? I, I, I'm, I'm, I, 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 so I don't know, I don't know. What are you going to do? Is the maker even aware? No, no. I'm not going to risk losing Kenny because of a maker. No, I can't do that. So how do you want to go back to? What's your plan? Honestly, I don't know. I, I just don't know. Even the TNC I tried last week did not work. What? You even tried DNC, Nene? Really? She plans to cover it up. Oh my goodness. Hey. It's... I don't know, it's... No, 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 this is unbelievable. This kind of deceit is completely unacceptable. Totally. Mm. No. What is wrong? What is wrong? Eh? Calm down, Kwan. Huh? Maybe his phone is on silence. We'll keep trying, trying more. <sighs> you know, I have told Nene time without number to quit living a dual life. One part sees her as a Christian virgin. <laughs> but she's not. She's totally the opposite of that. You know, I... I just can't wrap my mind around this thing, Cheta. Honestly, I'm trying, but it's hard. Huh. 
I know, I understand. I know Kenneth probably told you that he's getting married to a Christian virgin. Uh -huh. <laughs> Trust me, don't be fooled. <laughs> it's just fluff, my dear. It is. How? How could something like... I don't know, I don't know. I don't know. See? Nene only played along with what Wachi, Kenne's mother, wanted. <sighs> Lord Jesus, have mercy. Have mercy. Well, where is Chata? Where is that girl? Eh? Where you need her? You will never see her. But when you don't need her, she appears like an evil spirit. What is, where, where is she? It's okay, it's okay, she's coming. What is she doing outside? Is she not supposed to be here? Eh? With what is happening? Is she not supposed to be here with me? Just calm. Hmm? Calm. Ah. Keep trying, trying. Oh. Hey. Hi. Hey. Pick now. Pick your food. Is he going? No. Mine is not going. This is bad news. Very bad news. Mm. You know, you said that our desire makes us vulnerable to the seeds. Which is very true. What you... Kenneth's mother wanted a Christian virgin. And then it fits the profile. Because that was Kenneth's mother's desire. What she did was to exploit it. What a deceit. Wonderfully crafted. Perfectly created and excellently executed. Ah! Oh. Oh. Hello, MADK. Chata, there's a way you behave sometimes that I don't like. Let me just be frank with you. I don't like it. Uh -uh. What were you doing outside? Are you not supposed to be here? Knowing what is on ground, are you not supposed to be in here with me? Eh? Are you not the one that asked me to leave when I came in here? You said when you're ready, you'll call me. Uh -huh. Must I tell you everything? Eh? Are you not supposed to use your sense uh, and sense that I, 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 I need you here? Eh? You know what is on ground and that we're looking for, Kenneth. Are you not supposed to know that I'm worried and just come here on your own and stay with me? Uh -uh. It's okay. Sorry. What is it? Uh, have you seen Kenneth or have you heard anything? I've not seen my of us are looking for him. I haven't seen Kenneth. Hey! Hey! I don't understand. Hey! Okay, please, mm. just stay outside. Guard the door. Don't let anybody come in. My aunties and uncles, they are, they've been calling me. Everybody is worried. And I don't want to talk to anybody until I see Kenneth because I don't even know what to say to them. Please, just help me stay outside. Don't let anybody in. I mean, I understand. Don't let it get to me. Kenneth, please, now. Peek, peek, you know, no, peek. Hey! You don't look happy. Even you, you don't look happy. Before I left, you were happy, Luther. Even you, before you left, you were happy. Why are you reciting everything I have said? I am serious. What I'm saying is true. What is wrong? No, let's start with you. No, let's begin with you. You're supposed to be happy because today is your day. <sighs> I saw Chinemerim. What? 
Are you serious? I am serious. God, what does she want? She never has a son. You're not joking, are you? I am not joking. And the worst part of the whole thing is that today of all people, how am I going to handle all this? Brother, it's fine. It's okay. Everything is fine. Trust no, me. Tana, you, you don't understand. Everything is not fine. No, I do understand. Lotana, everything is not fine. Listen, I am paying an S dowry today. And look at how am I going to handle all these incidents? No, this stuff is not going to hold today at all. Lota, I am lost. I'll explain later. Right now, let's just move and pick up your son from Neme. You see that color not your mother forgot? It was divine. Lota, you are crazy. You are crazy. Listen, do you have the faintest clue of what my mother is capable of? Do you? Oh, brother, please. Enough of that. Forget your mother's control and opinion. Mokem, you are a man and you have to behave like one. Nene, I broke with each Cha cha. Nene is the opposite of everything you think you know about her. You're not just my friend. You're like a brother to me. Lota. Like I said, you see this bright price thing, this dowry payment, it is not happening. Right now, let us go and pick up your son from Neme. And honestly, I don't care what your mother does or says. Let's be gone. Lutana, please now. One more kunese. Don't leave me. No more can I know you garden. Okay, forget about this garden thing. Guys, see about I'll explain everything to you in the car. Bottom line, let's get out. Okay. You cannot. Okay, let me, let me go. Lutana. I, I, I don't understand. Have you been at dinner? Bros, man up. JTM Wagi, man up. What kind of color not did you go to buy that you kept everyone here in suspense? Eh? Thank God you forgot the color not. What do you mean? It means what it means, Mama. It is what it is. Are you talking to me in that manner? Mom, I have been your pop heads for years. But thank God, not anymore. Puppet? How? Pathetic that I realized it today and I say no to it. Hey! My enemies has gotten me. Uh, it's okay, son. We can talk about it later. Nugo, we can't abort it now. We can't talk about anything. Anything. Why? There are two variables here. The good news and the bad one. But I will start with the bad one. Okay. This okay. Nana here, this so-called Christian virgin you brought for me to marry, is not what you think she is. This Nana here is pregnant for another man. And the good news is Snemarami is with my son. Eh? Yes. Automatically, technically, I am a father now. And Snemarami is my wife. That is if she is not married to another man yet. And how are you sure it's your son? And what you said about Nene is true. Um, I am done explaining to you why this ceremony will not hold anymore. One them. Hey! Awawa. Chimo. Awa. And listen, I do not care what you do. I do not care how you take it. And I do not care what the outcomes will be. Hey! Oh, yeah, Awawa. Awawa. Yeah. And can I who did this to you? <laughs> <laughs> are you saying that to me? My good people of Lagos, listen. It is time for a new Lagos, one that works for you, for me, and for all of us. Our Lagos. And believe me, it is possible. To connect Lagos as has never been connected before, with all our rail and water transmission system delivered in four years, the go to end the traffic problems in Lagos permanently. Vote Labour Party. Vote LP. 
I'm Badi Boros Vaivor, and I'm Labour Party candidate for Governor of Lagos State. Responsible for all my actions, and it's so bad. 